All right, guys, it is moving day. Okay, so this is when we finally move out of our like 10th apartment and <laughs> we move into our house. It is closing day and she gets to go to school. I gotta no, do all the moving work. I, I actually don't wanna go to school. I'd rather move, but right. it's okay. But she has to go to school. school. So we're gonna, she's gonna help after school to help finish the move, but we will be in our new house tonight. We will give you a tour of here and then we'll give you a tour of the new house eventually. But yeah, they're ready to go. Are you ready to go to school? I'm ready to go to school. We gotta go. She's nervous. <laughs> Gracie, shh, sit. Shh, Grace, sit. She doesn't want us to leave. She's very nervous, she's pacing, she has anxiety. She doesn't know what's happening, but she knows that we're moving and she's afraid of being left behind. You afraid of being left behind, baby? You'll be okay, buddy. You gonna come with to the new house? Is it gonna be fun? Yeah. Somebody's okay. upset that. Never ever write anymore. It's getting real in here. People, she's, man, he's not ready. I just want to get the dropped off so we can go close. It's getting crazy. Why are you upset? Because he takes forever to do his hair. He's like, we're leaving, and then all of a sudden, service, wait, I've got to do my hair. Then he takes 20 minutes to get it out of the bottle. Then he's got it in his hand. He's got to rub it around in his hands. Then he has to put it through his hair. But then, but then there's too much then in there's his too hair. there's too much. Because he puts way too much in his hair. And then, and then, He's got to he's got to like brush it out and then all of it goes everywhere all over the floor. And then it's nasty and then Next, and then when it dries, happens. it's all crusty and then when you go through his hair, it's like, "Oh, I got gel on my hands." Not even oh, close to happening. First really? thing is you really? um you get the gel out of the bottle. So you slam it on the counter and get it out of the bottle. And then you rub it on your hands. Then you rub it in your hair. And then I'm done. And it, is it necessary to do all that in the morning? No. Yes. And make her late? Yeah. Why? Can't you do that like, before like you go to freak bed? Out. You like her see her freak out and you, you want to look good. Yeah. For the ladies. Oh my God, we're going to be late because we're talking about this. <laughs> Let's go. I am not going to lie, guys. I am super excited to close today. I'm hoping everything goes off without a hitch. It's just I'm ready to be out of the apartment. I'm ready to kind of get back into our regular life organized life and right now we're living in chaos but i'm super super excited do i look hip-hop with my <laughs> with your thing okay so we just got the closing money and yes. he made a funny he made a joke that he wanted to put in no they asked if we wanted to put a memo <laughs> on, on the, the closing check. No, on the closing check and i was like yeah, can we use emojis right because i think it'd be appropriate if we put the poop emoji show so I said, can we do thanks for the poop emoji show? And uh, So yeah, put those together. That's what he wanted to put on our closing paperwork for our house. And it wasn't I, directed toward the builder, but toward the bank for how confusing, and, not confusing. No, they just screwed up. They the, screwed up the end of the paperwork. Um, paperwork of getting the loan. So it was really for the loan people. Yeah. So yeah. So they were going to charge us four grand more for no apparent good reason. Yeah. So he has to make jokes. I do you like how the bank guy though doesn't even break. He's like, oh, sorry about that. I hope you have a good day, Mr. Schultz. He was very professional. Yeah, he very was. professional. Yeah. Hey, what's going on? Good, good. I found everything for you. We're good. That's right. Boom. Boom. We got the keys. The closing is finished and complete. It went surprisingly well considering how it was started and almost finished. So yes. we got the keys. We're moving in today. Today is moving day like we told you earlier and now we're going to go move a truck and unload a whole bunch of stuff. But we got the keys. It's all that matters. Well there's a lot that matters. I mean hopefully the house <laughs> everything's done in the house too. That still matters. There's probably a lot of blue tape. We'll there's probably a lot of blue tape. There's gonna be more blue tape. I wore a blue shirt to support the blue tape that's gonna be on all the walls. So but we, can it just, matter. we can just have you stand by walls that need to be fixed. <laughs> I'm like a blue tape master. It. Welcome to our new house. What? Welcome to our new house. Welcome to our new house. Dun, dun, dun. We can stay here maybe three, four years. Yeah, exactly. 
Wait, so we got the moving truck emptied for the first time, but now I have to stop to pick up Sutton from school. Then we have about an hour and a half break before I have to go get the other two from school. So I'm gonna pick him up, grab something to eat, because I am starving. And carrying the couch, two couches upstairs was a pain. The mattress is like, seriously, I'm already tired and I just want it to be done. But we're gonna keep plowing through. We have to go to the storage unit once we pick up all the kids to help pack up the storage unit in the rental truck, the moving truck, and then um, see, oh my gosh, now we got more stuff. So um, yeah, so we're on the way. Okay, so I picked up the boy, he is with us, and I am now going to grab something to eat from the grocery store, and you know what's awesome is my friend just text me and said she would pick up the other two from school. It's like a lifesaver. So now she's just gonna drop them off at the new house. So that gives us a little extra time to clean the apartment because we have to be out of the apartment by tonight. And things are getting crazy. And this is only day one of move because pods are arriving tomorrow and those movers are arriving on Saturday. Crazy. Which one do I want? Oh, that one. No, that one. Thank you very much. Oh, no, I don't want that one. That one, no. It's for four. Zero. Everybody knows that code. Weigh your bananas. Okay. Place your bananas in the back. Got my helper. And then when you also video baby gear for a living, you use strollers in very creative ways, like to carry your entire closet. Also, Sutton had fitted more on her stroller. Right. I think we're maxed out the capacity, though, of this drawer. <laughs> I kind of look like a bag lady with all of my belongings on a cart. I think you're good. Right there. You're good. Stop! Pick it off! Oh, oh, dirt bike! We can't lift this. Oh my Come gosh, on. guys. Should I get so, this? Dirt bikes are back. Four wheels back. All the outdoor stuff that we like doing is back. Open the other ground. Hello. So we got them home from school. Yeah. We got them home from school. Um, they're kind of helping. Yeah, no, she's helping no, a lot. Helping. He's playing football, but playing football. we're getting there. So now we are getting the the moving truck back with the storage unit stuff from Dad. We're gonna unpack it real quick and then. Um, yeah, and then here's the, the stuff that we haven't taken inside yet. There is probably multiple truckloads in the storage unit, guys. This doesn't even include the three pods. No. We need to thin out our stuff. We have too much. This is, this is crazy. This is barely anything. So we're unpacking boxes, and she just realized she has homework. Yeah. <laughs> you know, moving doesn't exempt you from homework. She clearly just figured out. So what do you think of the new house? It's really cool. Grace is really excited. You should see her. She's just walking around in circles. She isn't walking around in circles. She's trying to figure it out. It's her first time here. Gracie, what do you think? Hey, you, come here. What do you think? She's wagging her tail, so she must be happy. Can you tell him? Can you tell him how you think? What do you think? I think it's so cool that I get to be in a new house with my new sister. Ha uh, Sorry, my old sister. Okay, I'm kind of losing my mind because now it is dark out. As you can see, it's dark out. And everyone's like, oh, it's not gonna take that long. Every time I open another drawer, it's not packed. As you can see, another not packed drawer. Look, there's still stuff in the closet. There's stuff here. There is stuff here. The refrigerator guy is late. He was supposed to be here between two and six. Oh, there, we don't know when he's gonna show up, so we can't sit at the other house waiting. But if you would see over here, in the refrigerator has cold food that needs to stay cold. So what happens there is that I need the refrigerator at the other place. So I'm kind of freaking out. Moving officially sucks. I hate it. I hate all of this. Now look at this. Another closet. That's right. <laughs> it never ends. Just burn it all. I don't want any of it. It's like I can't. This is we were supposed to be done. Look at all of this stuff. I don't want to do all this stuff. I just want it to be done. So we're running out of time. We have no boxes left. So what we're going to do 
is we're gonna put coffee cups, which probably could break, into a suitcase, because it's the only oh, yeah. thing. That's a smart idea. It's the only thing I have. I don't even have any towels to pad them, so I'm really not sure how that's gonna work out. Plus, we don't really have anything to put the freezer food in. Oh, hey, look, we have paper towels. So look, packing breakables in a suitcase maybe is not the worst idea. Hmm. Change of plan. <laughs> the cups are actually in here. We found one last box. We and found one last box. Leftover dish rags. Yeah, so those are all the cups. And then, had some freezer food, right? But and no containers for the food. Nope, no containers. But we did have a suitcase. <laughs> so, one we suitcase. improvised, and here's all of our beautiful stuff. Not to worry, it stays nice and fresh with this beautiful ice pack. Yes, I found a bag out of nowhere. I don't know where it came from. But here you go. It's nice and organized, it's beautiful. There's all of our food, and that's all of our freezer food. But yeah, that was our change of plan. Yeah, now we're cleaning. Yes, cleaning, cleaning, cleaning. Okay guys, we did it. We finally have everything out of the apartment. Yep. It's mostly clean. I think it's pretty, actually it's really good. It's yeah, clean. Yeah, it's really good for five people living here. Yeah, right. and the thing is, we only have to leave the stroller. I'm gonna pick that up in the morning when I come and give them the keys and everything, but I think we have everything moved out. Um, mostly everything can fit in my car. I'm hoping I have to carry the Keurig because I might have to drive with it on my lap. I don't know. <laughs> but we made it. <laughs> We're very, very tired. She has homework. I still have homework and it's like, Almost nine. Yes, she has homework. We haven't eaten dinner yet. No. We're exhausted. We're super exhausted, but we have to get out of here. But like I said, look at this. It's empty. It's clean. We did it. Oh, if my teachers are watching, hey guys, <laughs> um, if, if, if um, this is why she didn't do it. I homework. may or may not do my homework, or, or be tired tomorrow, or I may be really tired tomorrow. So just right. Be attentive, I moved, I'm sorry. Right. Oh, and here's the thing, this is only day one of moving. We yeah. still have pods coming and we have to do all of that moving too. So I don't, I don't, I can't even wrap my brain about it. I don't even want to talk about it right now because <laughs> I can't. So let's go to the other house. Okay, quick update. It's gonna be really shaky, I'm sorry, I'm a really shaky person. Okay, okay quick update. The refrigerator did not show. They just didn't show tonight, no. which means all of our cold food is going to go bad, um, which means we don't have anything to eat tonight. I mean, even we didn't have that much anyway, but no, I just went to the grocery store to try to grab like a cooked pizza or something cooked because it's like 8.30. Yeah. All of the hot stuff is closed down. So now we're going to head to Chick-fil-A. <laughs> <laughs> our backup plan, which is good for with good with me. Yes. It's good with me, trust right. me. Yeah. Oh, holy brake lights, it's like making you all red. So yeah, yes. I know, that's what I was looking at in the camera. I'm like, oh, look, I'm red. So yeah, so we're gonna go to Chick-fil-A because everybody is starving and we just, we ate down to like hardly any food so that we could move and now we have no food. Well, we have no refrigerator, which equals no food because right. well, we, the food yeah. was bad. Right, and we don't want to make a big mess in the house. Like it's just, I can't, yeah. I can't do it. So I can't do it. Chick Fil A, it is. Chick Fil A. Guess what? We just arrived. We arrived in the meal delivery zone. That means we are about to have chicken and French fries. Wait, how does this work? There we go. Meal delivery zone. <laughs> it's embarrassing. Um, the fact that it looks like we have all of our worldly possessions in our back seat <laughs> of our tiny car, like we're homeless. <laughs> this is super embarrassing. <laughs> With the dog on right. our lap. Fantastic. This is great. Here he comes. Dolly? Yeah. Can we eat $2? Here you go. <laughs> Just take your good girl. Where's I didn't you know Chick-fil-A took your name. When they asked my name, I was like, what? Huh? What? No, because they, they asked that first, though. Yeah. I was very confused. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. By the way, I'm frustrated, so <laughs> hope you enjoy it. She's frustrated. Okay, so here's the thing, guys. We ate our Chick-fil-A, and now it is, what time is it? Like 10. It's really late. No, well, it's 9.30. It's 9.30. almost 10. She's doing her homework. She's very frustrated. I'm very tired. Everybody's very tired. We have a lot of unpacking to do before the pods get here, which is like three quarters of all of our stuff, and that's tomorrow, unpacking on Saturday. That's not fun. No, it's not. We have some other stuff to do that we have to do um, by end of the year, so it's kind of crazy this week. So that's it, guys. I'm going to end the vlog here. I will catch you. We will make another moving These teachers vlog. Teachers better understand. I'm just saying. I'm sorry. She's it's, having a really good time with her homework. Yes. 
Um, so this is it for the vlog today, the first moving vlog. We'll do some more because we this is like an ongoing process. So we'll talk to you guys later. Please subscribe, thumbs up this video, and yeah, head over to the Savvy Life and Junior Gizmo to also subscribe. All right, bye guys. Bye. As you can see, oh, also there is no refrigerator. No refrigerator is supposed to arrive tonight. So tomorrow's breakfast is the breakfast of champions. Pop tarts and bananas because the f <laughs> little food that we had left is all gonna spoil overnight. So we don't have any milk or anything like that. Yeah, so breakfast of champions. Dun, 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 dun.